Classic TV fans, Dave Sundstrom here. Thank you so much for joining me today. We're going to be talking about none other than Barry Williams, the actor who played the oldest son, Greg Brady, on various versions of the classic Brady Bunch television series. And in particular, I'm going to share with you all his thoughts about what Greg Brady might be doing right now if he were something other than a fictional television character. In other words, we're going to find out, at least in Barry's mind, what really happened to Greg Brady. But before I go any further, I've got to give credit where credit is due. I heard Barry share this information on one of the most recent episodes of the Real Brady Bros podcast, which is hosted by Christopher Knight and himself. Every now and again, the fellers just answer questions, and this was one of those episodes. So if you are a fan of the Brady Bunch, and I know that you are, then you know that the last time we saw Greg Brady was in the CBS dramedy, The Brady's. On that show, we finally get to see what has happened to the oldest of the Brady boys. Greg had become a doctor and was married with a wife and a young son. More on them in just a minute. But first, you might notice that one of the original Brady actors wasn't on hand to be part of this particular project. Sadly, Maureen McCormick was going through a whole bunch of things and wasn't able to participate. I guess I could have just said that, but any opportunity to share a photo of Maureen should not be wasted. So here's a good one. One of my favorites, in fact. Okay, getting back to Greg. Like I said, he was, for the most part, happily married and leading exactly the type of life that we would expect that he might. And his son, Kevin... Well, he ended up growing into Jonathan Taylor Thomas, who would star for years as one of Tim Allen's sons on the ABC television sitcom Home Improvement. But let's get back to Greg, because the really interesting thing is that Barry doesn't see everything working out for him. So on that Brady Bros podcast, Barry provided details about what he thought might have happened to Greg as he got older. Barry confessed that he felt like Greg had probably gotten divorced and remarried. And he thought that it was likely that Greg and his new wife would have a little girl. And in addition to that, he was not working as a doctor anymore. In real life, many of us have not one, but two or three careers before we retire. And Barry thinks that's exactly what happened with Greg. Speaking of retirement, let me just wish a very happy and well-deserved retirement to my dear friend Glade Butterfield. If the house behind him looks familiar, well, it's probably because you recognize it as the Brady home which was recently remodeled by the actors who played the Brady Kids, along with a bunch of really talented people from HDTV. No idea what they're planning on doing with it. However, on the same podcast episode, either Barry or Chris, I can't remember which one, said that he had heard that they might move the entire house to Las Vegas or something like that. Personally, I hope they leave it right where it is. Okay, one more picture of Barry and Maureen. You know that they were an item, right? It actually seems like Barry made the rounds a bit. From what I understand, he even dated his TV mom. No word on whether he spent time with Alice as well. Alright, that was then. This is now. These days when Barry isn't acting or podcasting with his TV brother Chris, he can be found on stage making some pretty sweet music with his band The Travelers. I've listened to a bunch of their songs and I've got to say that they're really good. I'll post a link to Barry's official website in the description section of this video so that you can learn more about them. I will also post a link to pick up Barry's book, Growing Up Brady. Of all of the Brady Bunch memoirs that I've read, I think this one might be my favorite. If you're a fan of the show, you really should check it out. There he is, Dr. Greg Brady. On the Brady's, he was an OBGYN. I wonder what Greg's second career might turn out to be. Although Barry didn't say, I bet he would like it to be something to do with making music. All right, now it's your turn, folks. Are you surprised by Barry's prediction about his TV counterpart? What do you think happened to him? Let me know in the comments section, and while you're at it, I would appreciate a thumbs up if you enjoyed this video. What the heck, maybe even consider subscribing to the channel. I talk about music, movies, mostly TV from decades gone by. You know, the good stuff. But most importantly, and as always, thanks so much for watching. What are we drinking, my lords? We're drinking water and orange soda. The chefs to the beat of dough. You really should try it. The flavor's just right. Orange soda, just one of 14 great Shasta flavors. Oh, you're looking over and orange soda. The chefs to the beat of dough.